Tesla software updates explained. So these software updates will pop up on your Tesla explaining that you have extra features now included in your Tesla. You can also see this orange clock icon. That means I have an available software update. Let's explain exactly what these are. So I can either install now or schedule it at a later time. So what these are, if I go under software and click on release notes, these are all the latest software updates that my Tesla had. Let's take a look. So now I can immediately download this software update with Wi-Fi, or I can wait for another time. Let's see. So now my dash cam viewer has updates to the views when I save the footage. I have no new scroll wheel functions that allow even more shortcuts to my scroll wheel. You can actually program your scroll wheel to open up things like your camera, your glove box, and more. So these software updates do require Wi-Fi. Now, a popular question, what happens if you do not have Wi-Fi? So per Tesla, the critical security updates will automatically be added to your car with no Wi-Fi through Tesla's network. But these details, all of these extra features like low power mode, which actually saves you range on your Tesla, these do require Wi-Fi. So what Tesla says is you can go to a coffee shop or even a Tesla showroom and that will allow you to download these updates. So again, and now my battery saves even more range with this new free software update called low power mode as an example. So again, to check, you go under release notes and you can see these recent software updates. Now, these don't cost any money. They're free software updates or over the air updates. You'll hear them referred to. So when you buy a Tesla, this is the only brand that's going to add more features to your Tesla. These are not simply software patches, which means security updates and coding updates, if you will. These are actual functions of your Tesla, security improvements and more. So software updates in a Tesla explained. Now you know.